Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Rogue Trader with me, Break It Dawn. Let's head towards System Speculo for Pascal's quest. And there's an event on Faustone I want to take care of first. Let's have the peasants take care of that. Oh, that's right. We have a shortcut to Furibundus. That'll make things faster. All right, we're out of holy gifts, so we have to get our hands dirty. go in and swing, but I'm not going to. The enemies of the Emperor will be undone. The wolf is on the hunt. Am I getting paid for this? Don't get too cocky. You've got a problem. I've got a prize. Faith without deeds is worthless. Commands I act. I'll do it. Some casual five hundred damage shots. Doubt is for the weak. In thy light I stand, and thy light I crave. So I messed up there and used reckless rush when I wasn't supposed to. As the Emperor commands, I act. I thought I was going to move over and then take out these two guys, but then I decided to loop around this way instead. I will endure. Not a huge deal either way. They'll write legends about me. That's it. That was easier than usual. There's less enemies, right? Because there's only the two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Only seven enemies? Yeah, there's usually more than that. I guess they got scared and so they didn't send as many. Or not as many volunteered. 
Uh, Faustone, yeah, that's where we gotta go. And Dargonus, that's... Ah, uh, do I wanna go to Dargonus for the event? I think we have a shortcut from Fear Abundance to get to Dargonus, so it's not too bad. take care of that side. Uh, let's run up and kick him, I guess. Rejoice in battle. I'll do it. Doubt is for All right, the dodge weak. this one. As the Emperor commands, I act. I'll do it. Not quite enough to get our heroic axe. Oh. Well, so be it. Alright, what do we got? Don't get too cocky. He shouldn't have to move. Am I getting paid for this? I can do that with the right incentive. I have to turn this on. Die in disgrace. Oh wow, we hit <laughs> hit the other guy too. I hold all the cards. I will carve runes out of your bones. Wolves red. <laughs> all right, this side should be clear. Our foes reek of cowardice. Give this task to someone lesser. Rookies. Sorry, buddy. Still trapped in here. I hunger for battle. Oh, where you going, buddy? Alright. <laughs> we'll uh go over here instead. End his turn. glory naturally I mean pop this and then spit up our momentum again I'll put my psychic abilities to use I won't object to it but of course Lord Captain the Emperor is on our side This one. And voila. I always keep my options open.
So I think the security stat for the planets is supposed to help take care of these events. I wonder how long it takes for it to resolve itself. Huh. Alright, delays. The Adeptus Administratum has mired the colony in a mind-numbing appraisal process, the completion of which continues to be delayed. Yeah, uh, use the interim as a lesson in patience and acceptance for plus one efficiency, or you get plus one security, minus one complacency, or minus two profit factor. The ruling circles readily adopt your philosophy. As they should, because I'm the head of the ruling circles. And you don't want me to bring the hammer down. Or axe in this case. Do we have a shortcut? We don't. I could hop down to here. Back to Kronok and then to Pontus Valancius. Because I have a shortcut there. It's still a few too many jumps I think. And we'll trigger more events. It's probably not worth it. But by golly. I'm not going to leave my capital planet to fend for itself. And we're getting more loot, and we're close to maxing out our reputation with the Fellowship of the Void. I like this fight too. I'll make an example out of you. I will do my duty. I need a foothold. Okay, too much for the layout, though, since Ofar can't, is at the <laughs> can't leave this area unless we destroy all this stuff. Tell me, and it is done. I'm glad for these random encounters and how frequent they appear, because they allow you to test out your build and your party. I've mentioned it before, you get a generous amount of experience from it. Level up very quickly. Which some could see as a detriment, because then you don't have really anything to look forward to. Oh boy. is worthless. Oh, the burning didn't kill him. I was hoping that it would. 
The enemies of the Emperor will be undone! Eradicated! Hey, that's convenient. We're heading to Kiava Gamma right now. Now, I could just ignore these encounters and let the ship take damage. I don't think that's worth it, since scrap is hard to come by without more void battles. Let us not dawdle. I'll make an example out of you. I'm not going to bother positioning. I'll see to it personally. Be gone. Well, that was a good start. I can do that with the right incentive. This battlefield air is good for my lungs. I'll make Ulfar the MVP this time. Don't get too cocky. I can do that with the right incentive. You've got a problem, I've got a prize. <laughs> Shot him once, guys. Attention, he turned around and then we blew him away. Well, that was a mistake. All right. Uh, there are a couple up that way. Let's go take care of them real quick. This turn to Hydrax. In a thousand sectors. Actually, let's uh, let her get a couple shots off too. Oh, I can do that. I won't do that. I'm done with this one. My soul. I thought we had a shortcut from Fear Abundance to Mundus Valencius, but I didn't see that when we were at the Fear Abundance system. Instigators. Preachers in the service of House Chorda have arrived in the colony. They agitate fiercely before the mob, but unfortunately, the planet's officials too often serve as examples of reprobate behavior in their servants, which begets even more turmoil among the common folk. Uh, leave the preachers be. Yeah, we'll leave the preachers be. After listening to the words of the preachers, 
Rabble starting to show more and more signs of disobedience and rebelliousness. That's fine. They're preachers, and we're faithful in this playthrough, so... Let them do their thing. Then we hop over to Modus Valancius. I wouldn't mind a few more random encounter varieties. Oh, I can get this one way too often. Rise to the top, or get left in the dust. I think it's my least favorite of them. These enemies aren't so clustered together, so you don't get those big multi kills. For the true power of humanity. The Emperor commands us. Oh, Doubt is for the weak. All right, just the two, technically, four left. I will bathe this battlefield in righteous fury. As the Emperor commands, I none can escape the Emperor's judgment. Faith without deeds is worthless. Eradicated. Nice. Shipwreck. A ship full of people and cargo crashed on the planet. Lost speakers are wondering if you have a claim to the lost ship. Why would I... I think roleplay wise, looting it would make more sense. You don't leave resources. So order the ship to be looted. Miraculously, the surviving part of the crew placed the cargo in your capable hands in gratitude for the rescue. I didn't say rescue, I said loot.
I believe there was a misunderstanding. <laughs> Alright, so System Speculo. The... right there. So, if we hop... Here, there... Then straight down, right? Or is that connected all the way up here? Yeah, I think it connects to this. So that's one safe jump and then a yellow jump. So the next safest jump you can have. Unsafe. Nice. All right. Augur's Anomaly. Have we seen that one before? I'm sure that we have. Let's see. Let's just double check. Okay, yeah, it's the bottomless pit. Well, neat. That worked out once again. Kind of have a little loop between all the events until we made it back to uh, System Speculo. All we lost was time, but we gained experience. Or inexperience. We didn't gain literal experience because we're max level, but you get what I'm saying. It's not about the destination, it's about the journey. Oh, that seems pretty good. Based on the portrait, that one looks really cool. There we go, improved heavy bolter. Uh, each kill with this weapon increases its rate of fire by one. Seems pretty absurd. But we're not spec'd for it, so it doesn't matter. Throw that in the trash. It's a shame that Jai seems to be built around using uh, Drukari and Eldari equipment, because I would like to give her a last gun. Especially knowing that she has her history with the Imperial Guard. I think that'd be really fitting for her. And I'm not a huge fan of uh, dual wielding anyway. I don't mind a ranged weapon and a melee weapon. That's fine, but like regular dual wielding, don't care for the aesthetic at all. But I'm gonna call it here for now. Next time we'll check out Pascal's quest and then return to Fear Abundance after that. But for now, thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next one.